so much for coming. I'm sure you're all wondering why you're sitting here on these salmon sofas. <laughs> but I can tell you that you are not here in vain. You are here because I'm going to set you a challenge. Chelsea girls, you're going to give me a super chic summer 2013 outfit. Something that you feel typifies the spring summer look. And Fasha, you're going to give me something a little bit more high street. I will then be comparing your outfits and decide which is more Monaco and which sadly looks more Magaluf. Is that all clear? Yes. <laughs> Jolly good. We will then be having cookies and lots of champagne to celebrate. BCB used to be good. Yeah, definitely. I love everything. I like the idea of having quite classic clothing and then like kind of, yeah, jazzing it up with like a statement bold piece. Fashion trousers are really in, but I just couldn't imagine wearing them. I reckon I'd look enormous. So Mark Francis needs an outfit from us. Right. And it needs to be Chelsea. Chelsea, so very chic. Very on magical. trend, magical. It's got to have that like pizzazz. So we need to think about the vision. Where do you see this girl? What does she do? What does she eat? What does she <laughs> smell like? Oh my god, I can see so much that I love already. He likes like high fashion, like looks. We've got to play to our, our advantage. They don't know what Mark Francis likes. I hate bodycon dresses. I think they're really slutty. Yeah, it's very Lucy Watson. What, being slutty? I know we both kind of like that whole monochrome vibe. Oh, yeah. I like, like a bit of monochrome. Yeah, nice, like these that. do look really good. It just nice. automatically looks a bit more expensive. I agree. I think, yeah, I think we should get something that's like, yeah, like a bold monochrome, like one colour, and then we can really like jazz up mm. the accessories. Can I kind of like that too? Yeah, I love the green. And it's quite like Grecian almost because it's just the drop. Like, do you know what I mean? If it was like white, it would look really Grecian. I feel like whatever we pick, we need to be really careful that it looks authentic because I can imagine Mark Francis just like walking up to us and there being this deathly silence and he stood like right in front of the mannequin and he just takes a breath in through his nostrils and he's like, this just smells like it's 70% acrylic. <laughs> I would just die. Are we agreeing on trousers? Are we going to shake on trousers? I mean, Whatever, I, I'm just Why are we shaking? We should just kiss. Well. We should do it the Chelsea way. Kiss. I really, really like it. I'm confident about this one. I'm confident about it too. Yeah? I don't know if naively so, but it looks great either way. Does it have the Chelsea seal of approval? Yes. Make it does. Love you. Love you. Winning to you, yeah. Totes to win. So these are the two outfits that have been proposed. So we have a sort of, I guess it's jade. It's like a dark jade. I like this, I like the fabric. It's silk, it's nicely finished. And I'm normally a fan of monochrome as well. I can imagine this being rather like a sail in a windy situation. I have to say, I've never been a fan of the elasticated waistband. Not too keen on the pleats. The flower is a fun addition as well. But I just feel that this outfit works really well. This is very wearable, it's very chic, it's very well cut. I like the fact that there's no platform. I like the work here. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually really into this look. A lot more attention has been paid to the finish and I think the material is of higher quality in comparison to Exhibit B. I think both teams have done well, but I feel my winner is the Jade Maxi dress. Would the winner care to step forward? Oh, uh, there we go. So excited! It's a Chelsea outfit. Despite our from <laughs> Despite the mannequin, Despite which was doing nobody any favours. Yeah, it's quite awful, isn't it's it? such a great look. I love the shoe. 
I love the bed. I, there is no element that I can in any way criticize. I think you've done exceptionally well. A noble effort um, by our fash tag team. Nonetheless, a very, very wearable look. We are going to take Betty here for a vodka martini slimline, definitely, because it looks like it was a struggle getting her into this number. Um, don't forget the shoes. Come on, we're getting out of here.